Today guys, I'm here in the Indian River Lagoon and it's mullet run. There's tons of mullet fingers and silvers all over the place here. There's predators, tarpon, jacks, snook, redfish, trout. They're feeding on these schools of fish that are all around us right now. I think we're gonna get some fish today. Look, 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 look. Jacks. Those are jacks. Dude, we need to be bombing. Yeah, I'm, I'm bombing that big thing right now. There we oh go, boy. fish on. Dude, it's heavy, it's like a jack. Oh, foul hook. Beautiful. Oh, a foul hook lady. Foul fish. hook lady fish, guys. <laughs> oh. Oh. Ladyfish. Now that right there, folks, if there were big tarpon here, that is the premier tarpon bait. I actually love these guys for shark bait too, but today, I'm gonna let her go. Feisty little girl. Oh my. <gasps> what is that? Oh my gosh, what is that? What is that? Yeah, that was a giant tarpon. He's still on it. That might have been a giant tarpon. Oh my. I saw that, dude. It came up like. Oh they got, they got, my. They got, they got, I mean, when we first got here, they were busting in that corner, so we can start making our way there now if you want. Oh, oh there we go. Oh. Yes. Bro, look at you. You're, the lure's half the size you are, and you just piped it. That, that is a death trap right there, folks. Oh my Deep God. Wire. Just, just, you're asking to get hooked. Okay, there we go, we did it, we did it. Guys, look at that jack. That's the lure he ate. Half the size he is. I appreciate your aggressiveness though. Here we go. Let's get one about 20 times that size. We also might have to wait for the tide a little, a little bit because the tide- High tide right now. Uh, going out. Hey, a little rout trap or? A rattle trap? Not a rattle trap. That's We're not a bass fish, huh? I mean, it could be. <laughs> that is money. Yes. Thank you. I'm gonna try this topwater lure right here. Tie a loop knot. I like loop knots on lures. It gives me, I feel like it gives a lure a little more action. Allows it to move more the way it's supposed to. Simple loop knot. And we just trim off the trace. We're good to go. They stopped dumping for a little while, huh? Yeah. Yeah, there hasn't been any algae issues or any. That's a snook. Any issues. All day. Yeah, so how deep does it go? Here we go, fish there on. There you go. Trout. It's a trout. Nice. There he is, jumping. Whoa. I think Josh is the only one that caught anything. Fish on, another fish on. All right. Another trout? We're in them now. It's a nice trout, dude. There he is, guys. Look at that one tooth. All right, let's let you go, buddy. Fish Chase on, is hooked baby. up. There he goes. How far away did you hook him? Way out. Let's double up. That's a nice trout. Oh. oh my gosh. That's the way it goes. That's why they're called paper mouth. Are they called paper mouth? They are. It's a good fish. Whatever it is. Could it be? Could it be? 20 plus. Yeah. Hey, don't splash me, bro. I'm your buddy. Okay, I see how it is. Yes. Guys, we got him. It's a nice size trout right there. Dude, this trout is so stocky. He's just stacked with mullet. Like, absolutely. Dude, this, he's, he's like three pounds. You can just see it, just like, look at look at this right here. That, that's all mullet. He's just been gorging on mullet all. Look, look, he's looking at you guys, he's looking at you. He sees you guys, he sees the fans, he's telling you guys, subscribe, turn on your post notifications. That's what he's saying, we're gonna let him go now. He's a, he's a good fan, oh, always. When you guys trout fish, if you guys don't get wet, I mean, you're not catching them. Fish, we're listening. It's definitely, a, Wow, that's a nice one, Jason. That's a bigger trout. Don't worry, we're gonna start biting for you. I like that trout. That's probably like 20, 22. Yeah, no, he's chunky. 
Dude, look how fat he is. It's probably three pounds, dude. Look, he's gonna feel heavy, watch. He almost jumped right in your waders. Yeah, he did. Nice not fish, bad, dude. Not bad. Dude, look how stocky they are. Yeah, they do got some good shoulders. I mean, that's that's also just they're eating big baits. And, you know, right now, I mean, whether it's a little greeny or a finger mullet, it's going down the pipe. <laughs> See you, buddy. Good job, Jason. I did switch to a darker color. So. Bro, this is working. Why would you switch? We wore them out yesterday on the dark color. That big? No, not big fish. Just a lot of our fish came on that dark color compared to the electric. Are the fish today system. bigger than yesterday or the same size? Well, I would say they're a little bit bigger. There was a couple that I forget who got, but they were probably in the 24 inch range or four pounds or so. Fish on! Yeah. Trout. Swimming right towards me. There he is. Nice trout. There we go. Nice trout. Nice trout. All right, see you, buddy. Nice. <laughs> that was a good catch. Good fish. Nice. Good fish. Feels nice. Could just be that I'm using 10 pound test, but we'll find out here. Ooh. Not bad. Oh, it's not actually bad. a nice one, dude. Let's not lose it. All right, here comes the twirls, folks. Barely hooked. Oh. You think I can grab a fish? Come on. Guys, that is called the palm. Beach release, and basically what the Palm Beach release means, I'll explain it to you guys because you don't know, or some of, you, some of you may know, I don't know. So basically, it could be two things. One, it's an excuse for losing a fish, which you know can be, or it's two, it's from the sailfish tournaments where they have a 30-foot leader and they just cut the line, like, yeah, got fish. I mean, if you don't touch the fish, in my, in my opinion, I like, I like touch a touched fish as a caught fish. I mean, obviously sometimes you can't always hold it. That trout, not a caught fish. I lost them in the last second there. But there's more fish around. Yes, there is. Oh, that's a good one. That's good. Oh man, he's got some, he's got some size to him. We haven't seen him yet, folks. We don't know what he is. There he is. That's a nice trout. A very, very nice trout. Still green. Oh. Dude, that paddle tail, I'm telling you, man. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna slowly take my time. Yes! Woo! <laughs> yes, folks, that's a cop fish right there. I got water down my back. There he is, guys. The speckled trout. Look at that face. Make sure you guys go and follow us on Instagram. That's what he's saying right now. Look at that. He's like, yeah, follow him. All right, let's let him go. Oh. The gear we're using today is really simple. We got a 3,000 size reel, 20 pound braid, we got a medium light rod, 30 pound fluorocarbon leader, a quarter ounce jig head, and we're using different variations of color for this paddle tail right here. It's a very small paddle tail, it's not that big. This is very, this is, this is trout candy right here. You know, early morning we were using an electric chicken color. It was a lighter green. Now it's a little bit, the sun's a little higher. We're making it a little bit darker. And this is getting the bites right now. Fish on! Oh yeah, baby. Oh, he's jumping. Come on. Here he comes, water skiing in. Nice trout. Come here, darling. How do I know what? I think it's a female. Uh, dude, he, he's slimy. Show him his boss. He's slimy. I was telling Josh earlier about how they're called paper mouth. And uh, the skin to them is just very soft. And I mean, you know, you get a little hook in there. Sometimes it just takes one of those little shakes and they're really good at throwing the hook. So that's another reason why they're called paper mouth. I'm gonna start doing the fishing photo of the week. We wanna get you guys more involved with the channel. So anyone that uses the hashtag Black Tip H, they're gonna have their photo featured in every weekly episode. So this week's winner is right here. 
It's a great fish. Thanks for posting. If you guys want to get your photo on our video, all you got to do is use the hashtag BlackTipH. So when the fishing's slow, guys, you got to find something to do. I mean, this is no fish bite anymore. It's completely died off. You see that pipe right there? That pipe. You got to try to get the lure in the pipe. It's just got to just change it up. So instead of trying to catch fish now, we're just trying to do some accuracy casting. Oh, I bounced off the rock, and now I got a snag. Oh, wait, oh, we're, we're out, we're out. Let's try that again, shall we? Watch out, Jason. In the pipe, baby. Woo! He's had a bite, too. Wow. Maybe a little mangrove snapper. We had a pretty good morning fishing with Jason. That's our man fishing and our friends from Facebook. We got trout, we got jacks, we got a ladyfish. We got tarpon, bro. Big, Gosh. Big, big. We would still be fighting that tarpon right now. It would have been going on forever, guys. Got some nice trout, some, you know, 20 plus inch yeah, fish. Dude, size. they were thick, guys. Full of mullet, a lot of fun. If you guys wanna go wading, check out Jason. That's our man fishing. Make sure you guys go and follow us on Instagram. Link in the description. Make sure you subscribe. Guys, if you like this video, please hit the like button. It really helps out. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time. Black Tip H Fishing is brought to you by Frog Tongs, designed for you, created for the outdoors, and Sudacore Nutrition.